Good morning you guys and welcome back to my channel for another video. Today I'm going to be filming a get it done with me homeschool mom, working mom, homemaking, all the things. I have a lot to get done today and I figured I could use the extra motivation and you probably can too. I feel like this time of year our to-do list can get really long especially when we are trying to keep up with like normal life. Um, you know, like homeschooling and working and keeping your house somewhat clean and livable, it can get really, really busy. So I'm just trying to stay on top of my to-do list so that way I do not get stressed out. If I keep up with things and I don't let them pile up, then I personally feel better. So that is what we are gonna be doing today. We are gonna be homemaking, homeschooling, and working from home, all the things that I do from my four walls here. So I do wanna thank today's video sponsor. It is Ana Luisa, and you guys are definitely going to want to check out Ana Luisa because it is their biggest sale of the year right now. Buy one, get one, 60% off. So you can get two gifts out of the way or get yourself something and then give something to your daughters, your mom, your sister, your friend from Anna Luisa. So definitely, definitely stick around. I'm gonna show you guys my new pieces that I got from them. But first, let's go over today's to-do list. All right, you guys, as I said at the beginning of the video, today's Get It Done With Me is going to be homeschooling, homemaking, and working from home because that is what my life entails and this list is the greatest picture of that. So today, I need to homeschool, obviously get all the kids' schoolwork done. We are doing a super full school day today where we're going, we're doing literally every subject, history, science, um, logic, electives, like all the things. So that is gonna be pretty much the majority of the day. I need to film and edit this video. I have a pretty quick uh, turnaround deadline on this one. So um, I'll be burning the midnight oil tonight. I need to film and post something else for another client. I need to submit my grocery order because we're celebrating Thanksgiving early and I need some fresh produce that I couldn't get ahead of time. I need to bake pumpkin muffins for tomorrow's tea time. We're actually gonna be having our uh, monthly poetry tea time out at the park. Uh, the weather's so beautiful. And so I'm gonna bring muffins because I figured that would be easy for the kids to have. I, of course, need to get in a workout. Um, today, I think I'm gonna be doing some weightlifting for legs. Uh, I need to take out my turkey for Friendsgiving. Today is the day we need to start thawing it out. I need to fill out orthodontic uh, paperwork. Kylie's getting phase two of braces, so goodbye money all over again. I need to call pest, my pest service. Um, I need to reschedule that. These are just like some housekeeping things I need to do. I need to wash my makeup brushes. When we were traveling from Michigan, something exploded in our suitcase and got all over them and I just had them in the drawer for literally about, I don't know, a week and a half and I need to, I need to wash them. Of course I have laundry to do, soccer practice to get kids to, and then invoicing of clients. So yeah, that is what I've got going on for Wednesday. This is one day of, of life and I'm hoping I can get this all done because like I said, if I don't, then I end up kind of feeling behind and actually being behind. So um, I've got to get done with these, with these things. Like washing the makeup brushes will be great, but if I can't get to that, I guess I could do that tomorrow. But the majority of things here, they have to be done today. So I need to stop talking and get to work. So whenever I'm filming, one of the questions I always get asked is where my jewelry comes from, especially when I do uh, layered necklaces like this and all of my pieces come from Ana Luisa. I would tell you guys that about 90% of my jewelry that you see me wearing in my videos is actually from Ana Luisa. I love them so much. The quality has held up through years. And that is something that I think is really important because I think a lot of people assume if the jewelry is not 
thousands of dollars, then you're gonna be compromising quality. But with Ana Luisa, you do not compromise quality with pricing. And that is because they give you direct pricing. There's no middleman or luxury markup on Ana Luisa pieces. So I wanted to share with you guys these necklaces that I got. Um, these, and I got some lipstick on my sweatshirt there. Didn't even realize that real life. Um, but I wanted to share these pieces with you guys because Ana Luisa's necklaces are perfect for stacking. As you guys can see, I have three different necklaces on here with these small dainty, um, charms on them. This one is like a little V. This is two circles joined together and that's a little daisy and all of the chains for the necklaces have varying lengths so that you can stack them, which is super cute and very in style. And um, it just looks really, really pretty. It's a great way to dress up just a simple sweatshirt like this, which is my ultimate comfort um, item to wear. And so you can look more put together and feel really good wherever you're going through the holidays, family get togethers, whatever you're doing with some beautiful pieces from Ana Luisa. So you can find all the links to these necklaces down in the description box, but I just wanted to share that little styling tip with you guys about stacking your necklaces. Some other really great things about Ana Luisa is that they are um, carbon neutral, and I won't go into all the details about what that is, but if you wanna head to their website, they have a lot of information about what that means and how they source and um, sustainably source their jewelry and the things that they use for them. So that is really, really awesome, and I wanted to tell you guys about that as well. So like I said, Ana Luisa is offering their biggest sale of the year right now. It is a buy one, get one 60% off sale. And I will have the link down below for you guys so that you can head right over there and get some of your Christmas shopping done. Maybe putting some in a stocking stuffer, like just great ideas with jewelry over there. And if you have like a teenager, they will just think that you are the coolest if you get them some stackable necklaces because it's a really cute and on trend look, like I said. So all the links to Ana Luisa will be down below for you guys. Go check out their sale. You'll be so happy that you did. Looking at Grace and Grit's first employee. <laughs> so every now and then I will have something that I can ask her to do and I think it's pretty cool that she helps me. Um, this is for an Instagram um, cl uh, client and so the video has to be cut and spliced into like a 60 second thing and she's actually much better at doing that on, what do you use on iPhone? Clips. clips. On clips. I edit all my YouTube videos on iMovie, which I, she doesn't know how to do that, but she's really good at clips because she makes a lot of funny videos. And so I've hired her to do this for me, I think like two times now and she's paid even though she shouldn't be. And um, so she's working on that real quick for me while I finish up some other things that I have to do for work, trying to get that stuff out of the way first before we start school. So we are gonna get a little bit later of a start on school. Um, it's 9.15 now and I've been awake since 6.30. So it's, uh, I had a busy morning, but we're almost done. I'll be able to put that post up and then we'll be able to start school.
because you're emotional. Yes, yeah. it is not logical to rely on emotion as a basis for truth because emotions are notoriously unpredictable, always change, and just because you feel something doesn't make it true. So emotions, that's real. Yeah, emotions don't have a connection to truth. Okay, number four. Besides the Kylie. Kylie. Oh, Kylie. <laughs> Besides the physical organ, what does the heart generally mean when using scripture? I so, the core. Yes, the, the center. Core of the core of your. day check-in it is lunch break in our homeschool day everyone's having their lunch and I just wanted to quickly share a little tip with you guys if you're a homeschooling mom this might be helpful for you but when I have days where I have a lot to do I definitely definitely utilize my lunch break to handle like calls um, if I need to make an appointment or I need to cancel something or I need to call someone, I will do my calls during our lunch break because the kids are usually talking amongst themselves. We're not obviously doing schoolwork when my phone is put away. And so, because if I wait to do my calls until we're done with school, sometimes places have closed if they're in different time zones than I am. So anyway i like to use my lunch break as i have my lunch to make my phone calls so that is going to be the next thing that i check off my list yeah, spend my time running around keeping people please but this is my favorite holiday it's a chance to start over new because i missed you so i'm letting go of everything but you these are the good times with you baby this year is just gonna be you and me Christmas memories, oh, and I've been long to hold you close, forget about and like I said, I knew school was gonna take us quite a bit today considering we started at 930 and the amount of material we covered today um, I'm still feeling very happy about that, but I can feel my energy starting to dwindle So I am gonna try to finish the rest of my list today. I don't know if I will actually get it all done um, but one thing that I need to do is make the muffins for tea time. So I am going to go downstairs now that, um, my oldest daughter is just finishing up her last bit of schoolwork and make those, um, pumpkin muffins with Olivia. And then we'll see, um, then I'm definitely going to clean the makeup brushes and then we'll see where we're at with time. Um, as far as making dinner early, I am going to make something pretty easy tonight. I went to Trader Joe's not long ago and I got some things that I only get at Trader Joe's that I had, hadn't had had in a long time so I think I'm going to take advantage of one of those meals. But yeah, 2.30 was the end point for school today um, for me and all three except one. So 9.30 to 2.30 with a lunch break today. It's a little bit longer than usual but still we covered all the things.
Okay, so it's brush cleaning time now that the muffins are in the oven and I have the timer going downstairs. Um, so this thing works so good. I got it on Amazon. I'll link it for you guys down below if you need a brush cleaner because it does a way better job than trying to do them by hand and I did not believe that they would be dry in minutes but they actually are so don't ask me why it takes me so long to do it when they need to be done but it did and so I'm gonna wash all these now So I wanted to show you guys one of the things that I always get at Trader Joe's that I'm going to be doing for dinner tonight um, because it's super quick and easy. So I'll take a fried rice bag. take a fried rice bag and mix it with a bag of rice cauliflower and then make some chicken egg rolls in the air fryer and scramble up an egg to add into the fried rice. Call it a day. Five minute dinner for a busy get it done day. So that is gonna be it for this get it done video with me, you guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it motivational. If you have any questions for me, post them down below. I hope you guys are all doing well and enjoying the start to the holiday season. Be sure to check out Anna Luisa and take advantage of that buy one, get one 60% off sale. The links will be down below in the description box for you guys. And I always appreciate when you use links when I share them. Please give me a thumbs up before you go. It's a free way to support my channel and just a nice thing to do. And I will see you all in my next video really soon. Bye guys.